Hey, a trampoline! I think I'll hold on to this. It might be useful. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. Good evening, I am Marvin the Marvelous. Prepare to be amazed, astounded, and spellbound by magical feats unlike any you've ever seen. Why bother? Everything is a mess. What's the problem? It's my magic cards. They're supposed to be in pairs, and I don't know which one goes with which. Until they're just right, I won't be able to do my famous card trick. Oh, I bet I can help you with that. That, my friend, would be simply marvelous. Thank you for this. You, I have a feeling, are about to save me. My, my magic show, my entire career. I'll do my best. <laughs> I wonder which cards match up. <laughs> Juggling ball. <laughs> A star. No, nope, those don't match. <laughs> A rabbit. <laughs> A magician's hat. <laughs> A magician's hat. <laughs> A magician's hat. They match. <laughs> A rabbit. <laughs> A rabbit. A star. A star. A juggling club. Juggling ball. Juggling ball. Juggling ball. That's funny. There's no match for this one. I'd better tell Marvin about that. I'm all done. But this card was left over, Marvin. It didn't have a match. Ah, the juggling club. The match for that card got lost when we were playing Peoria. That, my friend, is all yours if you'd like it. Gee, thanks! Ah, uh, ah, uh, not so fast. You deserve much more than a mere card. After all, you saved my show. Mambo, Jumbo, Hocus Pocus, Dominocus. A chicken? No, that's not right. Let's see. Abra, cut, Abra. Hocus Pocus Diddly Ocus. <laughs> there we go. I thought I lost my touch. A genuine juggling club. All for you. Wowie zowie. Thanks. Just like Mama Mobasa from the Cartown Zoo. I wonder if it is. Mama Mobasa, is that you? She sure is sleeping soundly. I wonder why she is at the circus. If I could wake her up, I could ask. I think I have something I can use to wake up Mama Mobasa. Look what I have. Fresh hot roasted peanuts. Peanuts? Am I still dreaming? This is wonderful. Why, I can't believe my old elephant eyes. Is that really you, Putt-Putt? It sure is, Mama Mobasa. Honey, it is so good to see you. Baby Jumbo and I are working with the circus this summer, and my sweet boy is having the time of his life. Oh, good. Maybe I'll get to see him, Mama Mubasa. He's an artist now. He does wonderful paintings. Wow! I'll definitely look for him. I'd like to see that. I borrowed that net from someone, but I don't remember who. I can return that for you, Mama Mubasa. BJ Sweeney asked me to help out with the circus. be where Mr. Sweeney keeps all the tools to fix things for his Big Top Circus. 
I bet Mr. Sweeney wouldn't mind if I borrowed this saw. It might be good for fixing things around the circus, as long as I'm very careful with it. Hmm, I wonder what this is. Hey, it looks like half of a recipe. I'd better hang on to it. Mr. B.J. Sweeney sent you to talk us into performing without a safety net. Tell him the flying Porkowskis won't do it. We refuse to fly through the air on the trapeze with the greatest of ease if we don't have a safety net. Won't do it. No way. And that's final. I wouldn't either. That would be dangerous. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt, and actually, Mr. Sweeney wanted me to help you. So, where is your safety net, anyway? That's the problem. Can't find it anywhere. It's been missing since we got here. Wait a minute. I might just have what you're looking for. I'll believe it when pigs can fly. We can fly, Paul. <laughs> well, sort of hammy. A bunch and a heat, Putt-Putt. You're welcome. Now you can be safe. The flying pork out. You can fly again. Come on, Paul. I want to practice my flying upside down trick. Okay, Hammy, we're coming. I do hope you'll come see us in the show, Putt-Putt. Oh, I will. I want to see Hammy do that upside down trick. It is a sight. Well, better start practicing. Oh boy, I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honka the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act, and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. I think this platform goes all the way up to the high wire. I wonder what's up there. Here I go. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. Do you need some help? The name's Eunice. And do I ever! I am having the toughest time trying to balance on this practice wire. Never happened before! I am baffled! I can tell you that! I might have something you can use to help you balance, Eunice. Well, this is my lucky day, isn't it? Can't wait to see what it is! I hope you don't think it's too bold of me to ask, but do you know a little something about music? Maybe a little bit. Why? See, I'm the circus orchestra, the circus conductor, and the circus accompaniment all rolled into one. And I've got a couple of teensy little problems. My pipes are all mixed up, and it seems like I have some old translation book stuck in them. I figure if someone can set my pipes right, I can get up enough steam to get that book out. I can help you with that. Oh, that is music to my ears. Now the key here is to arrange my pipes from the lowest note to the highest note. Okay, I'll try it. By the way, since you're being so helpful and all, I should introduce myself. I'm Bet Bandwagon. I'm Putt-Putt. Well, Putt-Putt, glad to meet you.
Okay, remember, arrange my pipes so they go from the lowest sounding note to the highest sounding note. The green light means that the pipe is in the correct spot. The red light means that the pipe is in the wrong spot. I think that most of the pipes are already in the right spot. This bet. Okay, here goes. That was music to my ears. My goodness, it's the honkish translation book. Well, however, did that get caught in my pipes? A honkish translation book? I could use that to talk to Honko the Clown. Oh, you most certainly could. Here, you take it, Putt Putt, and thanks. You are my musical maestro. Thanks, Bet. This is great. So are you, Putt Putt. So are you.